So today is Thursday, October 17th. And this is my daily rant for the day, boo. Okay. Now, I don't know if y'all seen the Orlando Brown interviews, all of them, right? From the ones where he was, ooh, gosh, gosh, ooh, did he this, 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 this craziness to the last one. So where he actually was making sense with what he was saying and he wasn't seeming crazy. Not the one with Jaguar, right? But it was an interview that just was released and he didn't seem as crazy as he'd be acting, right? Now, he said something very vital. He was like, you know, people pay him. On these interviews, don't get it twisted. He gets paid, right? Because you know and I know that if Orlando Brown does a crazy interview, it's going to get a lot of clicks. And people like Blab or any other media source is going to make a lot of money from the streams, the plays, whatever, right? So he said something that really made me think, right? And I was in the shower and I said, you know what? Let me talk about this in my daily rant. So basically, he puts on a persona. He creates a persona. He creates a character and he gets paid, right? He created that. And it goes to show that you can create whoever you want to be, right? Whether you want to be cray cray or whether you want to be civilized. Or whether you want to be the life or whatever you want to be, you create it, right? It all starts with your mind. So with that being said, why are we creating lives that we're not happy with? Why are you consciously waking up and indulging and in, in just creating this life, this persona, this characteristic that you're not happy with when you can just change it? If it benefits you to be crazy and toxic and you make money, then yeah. But if it don't, why are you doing it? If it benefits you to be sane you know, be accountable, be disciplined, then why are you, why are you not doing that? We choose who we want to be. We choose our reality. We choose how we're perceived and we choose how we perceive others. It's totally up to you. Now in his scenario, it might be a little bit far fetched because a lot of people, you know, aren't in the position to where they can get paid to be crazy online, right? But how amazing is it that we would tune in and Orlando Brown, he was not trending. Nobody was talking about him. And then he decided, you know what? I want to live a life. I want to create a characteristic where people are talking about me. So then he created this, you know, this image going to these interviews, talking crazy. And guess what? It put a lot of money in his pocket and it got people talking about him because what nobody talked about him before. Hell, they not talking about Raven Simone for real. So this is my thing. We have the right to choose exactly what we want to experience in this life. A lot of people have an unhappy experiences and don't even really have to do that. I went and looked at the vibrational frequency chart because every so often I like to check my frequency. And I realized that a lot of choices, a lot of situations that happened to me was because I was vibrating lower, right? I was living out of fear. I was in survival mode. And it caused me to be in a lot of situations and intertwined with people that I shouldn't have been mixed with, right? So this is my thing. I have to choose better. If I want to be in the frequency of love and enlightenment, because that's where I really want to be. I don't want to be in struggle. All of this stuff that's going on, this matrix life, I unplugged from the matrix. Matter of fact, I have officially unplugged from the matrix. That is the persona. That is the characteristic. That is the life that I choose for myself. Because I know doing that will help me more from physical, mental, emotional, and financially. It'll help me more than what I got going on now. So my thing is, it's time for us to choose better. Go look at that vibrational frequency chart and see where you at. Is it helping you? Is is, is where you at creating a lifestyle that you love? Or is it creating a lifestyle that you really despise? So realize that going forth. From this day forward, you do not have to live a life that doesn't make you happy. You do not have to be at the bottom of the frequency chart, right? You don't have to be dealing with nothing that you don't want to deal with. And you can create a persona. You can create a characteristic that can really help you to have the life that you really want. Do not settle. Do not compromise. And most importantly, trust me. When you die and when you go to the next level, you're not going to get awarded for living a life that doesn't make you happy. You're not going to be awarded for having a characteristic or having a, a certain persona that doesn't 
make you be the happiest version of yourself. You're not going to be awarded for being in the lower part of the vibrational frequency chart. You know, the fear, the doubt, the jealousy, the disappointment. You're not going to get awarded for being jealous all your life. Make the change. Don't worry about me. I really don't care what nobody else got going on. I Like I said, I haven't unplugged from the matrix. I'm not entertaining. None of that. Only thing that I'm focusing on is the characteristic and the persona that's going to make me happy and make me some money. Whether someone agrees with it or not, that's not my problem. Whether I do it and other people get offended is not my problem. Because at the end of the day, just like Orlando Brown, I'm going to be who I need to be for me. That's going to help me be the best version for me, my grandchildren, my son, my man, my mama, my everybody. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, that was my daily rant for the day. Just a little sprinkle, a little bit, a little sprinkle, sprinkle. I haven't really did. Well, I did some daily rants, but I ain't put them on YouTube. So make sure you go to my YouTube if you want to see all of my daily rants, all of my blogs, everything that you want to see about me and my life is on YouTube. I'm out. Peace.